Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dom and today we are checking out a Cydia tweak called Jelly Lock. This was created by Max Katzman and it's available in his personal repo and I'll be sure to leave that down below if you want to go check it out. So this is an Android lock screen and that's as simple as you can put it. It gives you the Jelly Bean lock screen on your iOS device and we're going to go ahead and check it out here. So let's back out to the home screen here and we'll lock the device. And as you can see, there's our little lock and we can slide it up to the circle where we can unlock it or open the camera. Let's go ahead and unlock it. Now we do also have some settings for this tweak. That's not where it ends. We can go into the settings app here and scroll down to the bottom where we have jelly lock. If we open that up, we can enable it or disable it. We also do have themes that we can select from. So we can select white, which is the default. We can select solid white. And none of these require resprings either. You can go ahead and just enable them right away and be able to check them out. And then we have iOS here. And so as you can see, those are the themes that are available. And we also have app shortcuts. So if we tap right here, we can set different shortcuts. Let's set one for the app store, two for clock, and we'll set the third one for Cydia. So now if we back out to the lock screen again, you can see that we have all of these app shortcuts right here and we can quickly launch them just by dragging up your finger to one of them. It's pretty simple and it's pretty elegant. So let's go back into the settings app here and we will check out the rest of the settings. Also in here, we do have the ability to customize the circle. We can customize the color and choose from a wide variety of colors. Let's go ahead and choose red. As you can see there, we have a red circle and then we can also customize the size of it and make it a little smaller if we like. And so it kind of shrinks it a little bit there and we can customize the overlay of the circle so we can have it sitting above the edge of the screen if we'd like we can just uh, slide it up a little more have it all the way off of there and so as you can see it kind of moves it up and then we do also have options to swap the lock and the camera if you prefer them swapped and have the lock on the left side here you can do that as well as adjust the size of the lock and the camera icon just by sliding up that little slider right there or sliding it down to make it smaller simple as that now we do also have the option to set the opacity. The further left, it will make it more transparent. So as you can see, we have a nice little transparent lock screen. And then we can also set vibrations on touching the lock or unlocking it. So if we turn that on, and I know you can't hear this or see this, but it does vibrate when you have those enabled. Overall, it's a pretty cool tweak. It's got a lot of customizable options for your iOS device. And like I said, it gives you that jelly bean lock screen on your iPhone or iPod touch. So go ahead and check it out, you guys. It's called Jelly Lock. Like I said, it's available in Max Katzman's personal repo. And I'll be sure to leave a link for that down below in case you want to check it out. As you can see, it's quite popular. It's been downloaded over 24,000 times. So go ahead and check it out and be sure to let me know what you think down in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, everybody. This is Dom and have a great day.